That body cam video shows the chaotic moments that ensued between the people at the bonfire and police, but it also shows grieving family and friends who had just lost a loved one. He died today. He's my son. East Haven body cam video shows the moments police arrived to a home at the corner of Bedford Ave and Stephen Street Monday night, responding to a large bonfire. The family tells us they were mourning the loss of 31-year-old Glenn DeGray Jr., who unexpectedly died that morning. It was a big goofball, you know, he'll make you laugh. But police say that night things got out of hand. They say the crowd threw snow and ice balls at firefighters who were there to put out the bonfire. The body cam video shows a snowball hitting a police cruiser and another in the air. Who just threw that at the car? Police say an officer was also hit in the head with a backpack. At one point, the video shows someone waving an object at officers. Put it down! Police accuse 56-year-old Glenn DeGray Sr. of threatening to start a riot if police didn't leave. He can be heard speaking to officers on the video. If you guys start something, I can make phone calls and have half in town here. You want a riot? I've done it before. He was arrested and charged with inciting a riot and breach of peace. A second man, 33-year-old Michael Serleglio, was also arrested. Police say he approached officers from behind. Those moments also seen on the video. Sir Leglio was charged with breach of peace and interfering with an officer. Both of the men arrested were released on bond and they're set to appear in court in April. In East Haven, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News. Gabby, thank